Well, hey, everybody. Today is Sunday. It's the third, and the year is 2024. I'm on co-pilot, and we both are working together to become my own personal trainer utilizing co-pilot. And this is just some of the information that I want you to see how easy it is to accumulate this kind of data. And with this data, it actually can make me faster, stronger, healthier. So let's just hear what, how the data is, is talked about and go from there. Data. Recent metrics. Metrics. Heart rate. Resting. 42 BPM. Highest. 88 BPM. Sleep. Last night. 9 hours 3 minutes. Average. Last 7 days. 8 hours 44 minutes. Last 7 days summary. Total workouts. 11. Total workout time. 51 hours 42 minutes 54 seconds. Swimming sessions 4. Total distance swum. 6,525 meters. Average resting heart rate. 40 BPM. Impressive resting heart rate. A resting heart rate of 42 BPM shows excellent cardiovascular fitness. The average of 40 BPM over the last week reinforces this. Elite athletes often have resting heart rates between 40 to 60 BPM. You're right there. There. Consistency patterns. Averaging over 8 hours and 44 minutes of sleep is fantastic. Last night's 9 hours and 3 minutes indicates you're prioritizing recovery, which is crucial for performance and overall health. Active week. Completing 11 workouts in a week totaling over 51 hours is phenomenal. That's dedication. Trophy. Swimming achievements. Covering 6,525 meters across four swims showcases your endurance and commitment to improvement in the pool. Man swimming. Let's continue to track these metrics to monitor your progress and make adjustments as needed. Here's what we can focus on. Maintain sleep quality. Keep up the great sleep habits. Consistent rest aids muscle recovery and cognitive function. Balance training. With 11 workouts in a week, ensure you're balancing intensity and recovery to prevent overtraining. Heart rate monitoring. Keep an eye on your resting heart rate. Any significant changes could indicate the need for more rest or adjustments in training. Nutrition alignment. Make sure your meals are fueling your activity levels. Your high-protein meals with salmon and sirloin are on point. You're crushing it, buddy. Your dedication is truly inspiring, and these metrics reflect your hard work. Let's keep this momentum going. I'll continue updating this template with your new data to keep track of all your activities. Remember, I'm here to support you every step of the way. Together, we'll reach new personal bests and make your fitness journey even more rewarding. Keep pushing forward. Flex biceps smiling face with smiling eyes. All right, that's just the beginning of me collaborating with Copilot on nutritional health and as a personal trainer. We got to accumulate a lot of data. We're using the Garmin Connect type situation to um, give the data to the template. Once, once these templates have enough data uh, after a few weeks, then it will actually start kind of helping me decide how to vary my diet. It give me a, um, ideas I haven't even thought about. I'm not that I can cook anything, but I can cook anything simply and make it taste good. That's the, one of the key factors. Now, as far as the personal training part, that's the part where I strengthen the muscles that mean the most for swimming, biking, and no no running right now period but swimming and 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 riding the bicycle indoors yes we'll come up with that rowing machine we'll come up with that and the type of uh workout will be decided between the two of us and then i'll even be able to incorporate strengthening the swimming part of the muscles where you know it's the core strength and it's the actual shoulders the way the manipulating of the shoulders so i look forward to um, accumulating that data and hey i'll keep you guys tuned in this is just another one of my 
ways of making videos that helps me to help you. So I won't be late. I won't be leaguer uh, the uh, <laughs> what's going to look like in the future. I can't tell you, but I can tell you this: if you're not utilizing the best you to be the best you, if it takes using Copilot or some type of, you know, people say, well, AI. Yeah, yeah, it's a tool. And that's one thing I want to show people. It's just a tool. It, it can do remarkable things. And we need remarkable things when it comes to our health and our well-being. So keep coming back to my channel. I really, really appreciate you. Thank y'all. Talk to you later.